Hi, welcome to the annual In Art Show. It's a pleasure for us here at the Hallberg Center for the Arts to be hosting such an amazing show and want to take a moment to talk about what gave us the idea for this juried exhibit and the process of what it takes to be displayed on these walls today. But there are so many pieces and a lot of good ones, but it was um, challenging. But first, we would like to be sure to take the time to thank you. This activity was made possible by you, the voters of Minnesota, through a grant from the East Central Regional Arts Council, thanks to the legislative appropriation from the Arts and the Cultural Heritage Fund. So, thank you. You're judging a sculpture versus a textile versus a watercolor versus a painting, etc. So you've got to suddenly create not just a criteria for a painting or a sculpture. And so there's a lot of different things to take into account there that was um, a bit of a learning curve. The In Art Show is a unique competition in that it pits art against art. There is no category for just photography or sculpture or watercolor, etc. This poses quite a challenge for our judges, as they have to evaluate each specific art piece as a whole, not simply in a specific category. To get here today, the artists were first asked to enter into the art show via an online submission. After the deadline, the judges received the submissions and began their juried process. In scoring the art submissions, the judges give each work a minimum of zero to a maximum of 20 points in six areas. The scores were then averaged. This is because if a judge needs to abstain from rating a piece for one reason or another, it won't affect the score. The six areas encompass composition, creativity and innovation, technical skill, execution, the level of professionalism and craftsmanship in presentation of the artwork. The judge's choice, which is purely objective. I, I can be very judgmental, uh, but suddenly it's a community effort. So you have to take into account your own personal criteria and then theirs. Came up uh, two or three, three hours before the show and we walked around and we picked our top five uh, our top five pieces. And once we did that, again, we did not uh, meet on it until after we picked our five, and then we went around and kind of uh, talked a little bit of what we saw. And it's interesting because uh, the other two judges, uh, lot, we were all kind of on the same page with most of them. And finally, the quality of the image used to submit the piece of artwork. Now it was time to hang the show. Our experienced events committee staff carefully hung or placed the works in the gallery, giving each piece good visibility and lighting. Finally, the day of judging. The judges spent the next few hours discussing the artwork between them, collaborating and deciding which pieces were to be awarded winners in the ranks of artistic merit, artistic excellence, and judges' choice. All this brings us to here and now, tonight's opening and award ceremony. Thank you to all the members of the Wyoming Area Creative Arts Community who have put in hours of volunteer time. It is because of you that tonight's opening is possible. And once again, I want to thank all of you for not only being here tonight, but for being part of your local arts community. It's because of you that art happens. Thank you.